Yeah. Yeah. Our hearts and our minds and our hands to welcome an inspirational talk from the chairman of the committee on water, no other than our big brother, Councillor Tata Tamola. My respects to our mayor, uh, Mayor Salso Regencia, and of course, uh, Vice Mayor Gemma Veracruz, and uh, the councillors, Councillor Raya Gatan, Raya Tui, Maki Makapagal, uh, Tony Bioni Plango, Sol Maxarpan, Noli Pardillo, and uh, the rest of the department and division heads, and of course, last but not the least, the strong men and women of City Hall. My Bunta. Yes, uh, conserve water now. This is a call to take actions. This does not refer to anybody, but it highly refers to everybody. Indeed, water is life. Water is one of the most important substances in order for us to sustain life. We cannot lead our day to day living without water. It is a fact that it is among the basic basics. Our lifelines can't be fully functional without it. One example for this is our hospitals. Another health hazard we bring without proper sanitation. And sanitation refers to water. Because according to the experts, as you can get on the TV and newspapers, they advise us to wash our hands, to wash our hands as frequently as possible. Now, sa ako kung paghugas, sa buhay mo tulog sa atong grip ko, right? You know, I am not a prophet of doom. Nala ko yung basahan ng mga ko. It's an article, the front page to the newspaper, not the local newspaper, the national newspaper. It's stated there that uh, he's a pandemic expert. According to him, two-thirds of humanity will be wiped out. Wow. Magkapanimbarot yun. So kita, di maging kahit, di maging to first world, we are a third world country. So ato na lang yun is prevention. Di mo kita ka afford ang mga mga tambal, mga chicken, mga chicken. Pero ang hospitals na may kaya ako ng bibig. According to Councilor Ian Will, it is a illegal. I think we can only accommodate usap ng limbo pa sa inti, and that's it. No, ang upat asa na to pamutang. So the best way is to sanitize, to wash your hands. Ah, kani pa rin kusa ako ng asa. In cargo, ah, kani lang salt and water. Kaya ang pneumonia daw ang unang igot sa Australia. Right? So, we're going to prevent it. And not only that, if you look at the bag, the first one you have to tank on is, you have to be able to drink. If you have to be able to drink, you have to be able to drink. So, it's important to be able to drink. Now, we cannot imagine life without water. Other than drinking and housing purposes, water is important. Conservation of water is important to our goodness and for, and for the future to come. We need to take initiatives to save water whether there is scarcity or not. Water is a very crucial substance which at the same time is scarce. Now, uh, I'll be reading a report. This is... Uh, we can miss ICWS and, uh, and uh, from Philip uh, PSA, not from uh, Philippine PSA, uh, Philippine Statistics Authority. Ang ating water, out of 100 percent, 40 percent ang ating nagagamit sa sila. So actually it's not 40. The real figure is 33 percent. And the 60 percent, actually it's not 60, it's 65. No, wala ang doon. Muna ay atong deter, mga proper term is NRW, non-revenue water. 
So, kuring tapos sinto lang atong nagagamit ang 16 na nanawal. It's because of our broken pipelines. And, frankly speaking, it's because of our illegal numbers. So, just imagine, kung atong ma-reverse na, kung atong nag-introduce na, kung nangyong rehabilitation or no, na naging bagong pipelines, we can reduce the 60% to 30%. Come to think of it, nag-handle kayo mga barangays ang atong mapatulidan. No, ito mga low, ito low pressure, ato ba sila na taga-activate? Maybe 24 hours, at kung hindi mga ni 24 hours, maybe half a day, 12 hours, that's enough. That's okay. Kami dito sa mga dalipuga, ako, in time chance, mabot na yun ang tubig sa amo. Kaya ako, 19 years na dito na puyo, o again, tao ko katilaw ng ICWS. Now, di pa matunaan sa atong kaubal sa konseho, anan doon ng mga konsehal? I will not mention their names. Kaya tanan mag-iat, voted for yes. Even the opposition. And of course, ang atong pinanggang mayor, Mayor Celso Regencia, Vice Mayor Jemar Del Cruz, ang kaakuhan, which is commitment, alang sa kalambuan, for development, o kahiusahan, which is solidarity. Diin, ilang diaprobahan ang kapin sa 30 milyones na kantidad sa proyekto sa patubig. Now, kanilang akong dimension, kaya mo mali ang latest natin na nabanday. The rest, naghanak ka itang in fact, nag-ground break na ito, kami ni Vice, kami ni Mayor dito, and all the other councillors, nag-ground breaking, nag-turn over. So, kini, ng mga proyekto na glantog sa water system improvement and rehabilitation of Abaga Spring Source 1 of Barangay Suarez. Kami ka sa ito. Now, kaduha, ang rehabilitation of distribution pipeline for water supply to Carbide Village, Green Hills, Ubhai, and Orellana, Barangay Tumor. Installation of inline booster pump for Kurok, Kalkata, Barangay Tumor. Now, among kinasing-kasing na kasalamat sa tanang ilabi na ang buhatan sa ICWS as I considered by ICWS family. Diin, di lagi dihatag ang ilang panahon o kahibalo alam sa pagpanday ni ini ng proyekto. O sa tanang ang kampo para kini mahimong nagmalampusok. Now, by end of this month, I hope we can finish this because we created a water task force. It's composed of the academics, there are five professors of IITs, and I'm into some of the expertise. And all our retired and active na mga mechanical and civil engineers, and business sectors, chamber of commerce, we even have a representative from the religious sector, etc., etc. Now, maybe end of this month, we can give the proposal to Mayor Celso Regencia na kanan atong patungko sa dito kanan. Because may mabali atong pinakitakong water source. So hopefully, ato nang matubuhan 24 inches down to poblasyon. And in simultaneously, ato kong mahilisan ang tubo which is one day na tubuha, cast iron pa ni, during the 1950s, from Tubod to Mahayahay to Pagreso. And that's only for you, sir. And that's around 145 million. That's our first phase proposal. And the second phase proposal is na nakapong patubo sa Subanglu, sa Panglu. I think we're aware of that, no? Asa na na sa Abuno. So again, that's another estimated lang, that's another 110 million. So, di na na mga agis sa Abulo, Ipanoy, Tubod, Palao. So with that, proposals, I hope, na ba nung magyo kong supportahan ka tayo ng mayor, kahit na yung tubig, very important to us. Especially kami ng gawas ka rin ng masakit. So not only that, we really need water. We need water to be in the water. So again, pray for us, no? Taking more energy, atok ng anday.
So again, di ako maglangan pa. Uh, daghan kay salamat and God bless us. Thank you.